Hey, this is Rich Osweiler coming to you from the 2012 Winter NAM show for PremierGuitar.com. I'm standing here with Jim Boje from PV Electronics, and we're going to talk a bit about a couple new offerings on the bass side. Jim, how's it going today? It's going great. Couldn't be better. Well, uh, what do we got here? I know we got the headliner amp and cabs, and also a new signature model uh, bass for Rudy Sarzo. Let's check it out. That's right. This is the uh, new PV Headliner bass amp head. It's a very, very lightweight, efficient amplifier. It's Class D powered, 600 watts. As you can see on the front panel, we have uh, an active and passive pickup switch, so you can compensate if you have active pickups uh, or passive pickups. Pre-gain, um, uh, in the tone section, we have three switches. We have bright, contour, and crunch, which gives you a lot of cool tone options. We have the graphic EQ section here in the middle. Uh, it's all spaced on very musical frequencies. so. Uh, it's really easy to dial in a really good tone with this amplifier. We have a built-in optical compressor um, and DDT, which is PV's exclusive uh, anti-clipping circuit. It's a, very, it's a very cool speaker protection circuit. We debuted more than 30 years ago, and it's still standard on PV equipment today. So it helps protect your speakers. Now with the headliner head, we have matching cabs. Uh, we have a 115, uh, we have a 410, and a 210 cabinet. Okay. Um, and those uh, are designed to, to match the headliner head. So Jim, it looks like you have another cool new offering on the, on the base side of things for PV. Uh, this looks like a, a combo. It's called the Max 115. Can you tell us a bit about it? Yeah, that's right. Uh, PV uh, has redesigned its entire Max series of combos. These combos range from the 115 all the way down to the 126 and 158, which are very small practice amps. Um, but the 115 is a, a new combo. It has a lot of power, and Bobby Baldwin here is going to tell you a little bit more about it. Excellent. Hey, Bobby, how are you? Uh, on the Max 115, uh, we've really upped the power. The previous Max 115 was uh, 50 watts. This one's actually 300 uh, Class D. Uh, it's got a built-in DI. Uh, it's got a built-in Active EQ with uh, three voicing switches, punch, mid shift, and bright. Um, it's got the uh, trans tube boost, which is like a built-in distortion circuit, built-in chromatic tuner with mute, and the mute on the chromatic tuner actually uh, mutes the DI as well. And uh, one thing that we have now is the uh, psychoacoustics technology, which is a, uh, it actually uh, looks at what bass notes you're playing and it adds harmonics to give the illusion of having more low end. Okay. So it's, it's a way of getting more low end without having to boost the lows and eat up all your power amp headroom. It's, it's analog, it tracks on chords, and uh, so we're really, we're really happy with this one. So Jim, let's talk about this new signature model bass for Rudy Sarzo. Yeah, uh, Rudy Sarzo has been a PV endorser for almost 30 years. Uh, ever since he was, I mean, he was with uh, Quiet Riot, White Snake, Dio, Blue Oyster Cult, all those bands. He's played PV gear in one form or the other, and he's had a PV signature bass in the past. And uh, what we did here was we designed a new bass with him. It's in our Cirrus line. Uh, which is really known for being uh, very you know, finely crafted instruments, exotic woods. And this is really no different, um, except for the fact that it's using bamboo, which is a, a new twist to the story here. Now, bamboo is a sustainable material for instruments, and uh, that was really important to Rudy uh, and, and PV to have that. Um, it was really, right on. really important part of our collaboration here to have sustainable materials. It means a lot to Rudy especially. Um, so we have chambered bamboo wings here. Uh, we have mahogany neck through with, uh, excuse me, a maple neck through with mahogany stringers. We have PV's VFL active electronics system, um, 15 uh, plus or minus 15 dB cut or boost, low, mid, high, and volume. Uh, we have Rudy's signature eyeball fret markers. These are from his original uh, PV signature bass. And is this the uh, first time PV's used bamboo for, for one of your instruments? It is. You know, we've actually, um, we're making composite acoustics guitars, which are graphite and carbon fiber. And so we're really, uh, we're really interested in expanding what we do as far as sustainable materials go. And of course, composite acoustics, acoustic guitars use no wood. Um, and so this is an interesting sort of thing for us to do, to actually use a wood product that is more sustainable than what we would traditionally use for, for an, an instrument here. So um, we had a press conference today where Rudy um, talked about this a little bit more, and um, we're looking forward to a lot of big things with this bass. Well, that's awesome stuff. Jim, thank you so much for, for the time, and can you let the folks out there know where they can find out more about uh, PV's new offerings? Absolutely. Just go to www.pv.com. Thanks, Jim. This is Rich Osweiler from PremierGuitar.com coming to you from the Winter 2012 NAMM Show.